Hey, hey guys, Brian Ponnell here. Just a very quick, very, very quick video just to show you the inside of SEO Neo from the guys that brought us SEO Autopilot. Now, um, I've not set anything up. I've literally just this second installed it and put my details in, login and username. Um, so I thought I'd just have a quick look through. Um, I've not had a look at any videos or anything like that just yet um it was literally just a quick over the shoulder have a look see what's what's in here so um let's have a quick look at what fixes have been done chrome on mac um proxies delete proxies that don't work duplicate post backlinks okay that's quite handy articles without html in preview um okay Word AI, wiki fails fixed, web 2.0 profiles fixed, um, spin rewriter, refractor, uh, mic wiki, WordPress Tumblr, etc. So, okay, image capture solving added, cloud blogs, and then open AI limit increased to 100. So it's got some open AI and stuff in here as well. So even though this isn't even launched yet, um, you know, we're getting there's updates and stuff happening, which I'm, I I love straight away. Right. Um, so campaign, obviously, I've got no campaigns in here because I've not done anything, but just have a quick walkthrough of it. Accounts, you've got your buckets and then your templates. Your buckets, I'm guessing, are your um, um, like your different drives um, different kind of drives right so you've got aws and all that kind of stuff templates um so that's email templates and i suppose it looks like we've got to create them content buckets okay so this is where you put your content diagrams okay look at this oh wow yeah Nice. Now this is my kind of diagram, right? If anybody knows me, knows I've been around for a long, long time using these kind of tools, and this is the stuff I love, right? That just coming from so many places that there's just there just can't be a a footprint. Now, obviously, you've still got to be careful when I say can't be a footprint. There can always be a footprint, but the the more randomization that there is, the better. Okay. Um, so that's domain authority stacking so it's just you know linking two and two and two to you know um, okay nice okay and you can create your own um, let's have a quick should we have a quick play at creating our own diagram that's supposed to be test you got your money site. So I like to have. Oh, contextual in the main coming to my money site, right? Um, it's probably a. These wikis, I don't really like wikis to the money page, but I'm just having a play right what, you know, in front of you here so you can see what's going on. Cloud blogs. I'll probably be able to. I'm pretty sure these are contextual, so I think these will be nice. Um, and your PDF. Yeah, they can be contextual. And then URL shorteners just for a bit of indexing juice I think really that will just split them up we don't want that we want to just you know, do some more like that um, nice okay so that's that and then cloud blogs okay I'm going to, well, I am I'm not going to save this because it, it was just to have a quick play and see what we can what we can do so let's delete it cloud blogs warning you have only save yet yeah, leave that and then uh, Generate a cloud blog. 
So these cloud blogs will be in your buckets, right? So they're like your Google Drives. Um, God, there's so many of them. I can't, my brain, you've got AWS. Um, and my brain is absolutely blanking on me. Um, you can probably use the Microsoft version as well, and you know, create um, like Microsoft Word documents and all of that. Um, PowerPoints, you know, the same as what you can do with with Google Drive stuff, really, right? But you know, I like to be able to use the Microsoft stuff as well because it's actually got really, you know, decent high power as well. Um, I've has actually had some really good results with that. Um, so I was looking to see if I could find something that I could just show you, but it's all client based, so I can't. Uh, then settings, let's have a quick look in settings. Uh, so you've got your proxies, so you put your proxies in there. Third party API, so let's have a look. So you've got your captures, you've got your spinners, content sources, article forge, and then you've got open AI, nice. Indexes, so they've got their own indexes in here. Um, so that's that, those two. There you go. Right, so. Um, nice. So we can actually see everything that they that they use here. So all these cloud buckets. And then visual settings. Well, I'm already in dark. Layout. It's not changing anything, but you know it is kind of beta. But we're so the so Azure, Azure, um, you can get your probably not anymore. Um, okay, that's fine. Nice, nice. Loving it, right? Okay, guys. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna sod off. I just thought I would um, quickly show you this, um, and then I'm gonna learn it, and then I'll come back and I'll do some um, like over the shoulder kind of videos and all. All right. If that's something that you want to see, leave a comment below and let me know. Cheers. Bye.